Hi everybody, welcome back to Nellie and Ruth Designs. And today we are going to um, make a couple tags. I'm going to make a couple tags for the Lazy Daisy Journal. And this is a new digital I wanted to share with you that I ran off for the um, journal I'm working on. So this is from Digital Fit and they can be found on Etsy. It's D-I-G-I-T-A-L-F-I-T, -I Digital Fit. And they have a lot of really pretty images, all kinds of wonderful um, digitals that you can purchase and use in your kits. Um, but I want to thank you for joining in, watching, commenting, subscribing. I really appreciate it. So I'd like to show you um, the, I think this was 10 pages that I purchased and these are really pretty and I want to cut out a couple pockets. I have a couple tags here, um, that I made. I found some really cool six by six paper in my stash and it's of vintage, um, sewing patterns. So I have a pink and I have a taupey color. Um, I also caught, cut from my porch prints the tickets. I've got some daisy, a row of tickets here. And I pulled out a couple <clears throat> other ephemera, little ephemera pieces that I might want to work with. And then I have my, my box of goodies here that I can choose from as well. But let me show you these because they're very, very pretty. So I'll go through these here. These are pockets, obviously. Another pocket. And these are really cute little tags. You can see where you can punch a hole. Make a little pocket with those. And I run this off on my photo paper. Um, and I did choose the white because these were a, a little darker and um, vintage -y style so I wanted them a little bit brighter you can see they've got the dark back room, background so I didn't want to run them on a beige or a cream color I wanted the the white so the daisies pop these are very pretty so I'll be cutting these up um, probably tomorrow but Right now, I'm going to grab a couple of these um, pockets. I want to use this one, and I think I might be using that one. I'm not sure. Let's see if there was another one here. Okay, so I think I'm going to use this one. And these I will set aside. Ah, so I hope everybody had a good day. And I said a good day because it is 8.38 um, p.m. And as soon as I get done with this, I'm going to make a big bowl of popcorn. <clears throat> grab my two doodle girls and we're gonna cuddle up on the couch and watch a movie um, the movie I want to watch I probably shouldn't watch this week because I'm I'm home alone um, But by the time you see this, my husband and son will be back. Um, and I really want to watch Zac Efron um, portraying the son of Sam. It's probably something I shouldn't watch. Home Alone at night. So I may wait and watch that during the day. 
Um, what is happy and go lucky that I am and love a good comedy and want to laugh all the time. Um, I really like the movies about serial killers and the documentaries. Birds are still, I don't know if you can hear them in the background. I have two very large arborvitaes outside my craft room slash office window. And um, there's all kinds of nests in both of them. And you'd think if the birds would settle down, it's dark outside. But they are still talking away. I think these are very pretty. So I think I'm set on all my um, my daisy printables now. So I'm going to score the front just a little bit so I can flip it over. score the other side um, and it's very windy too we've had rain off and on we have cold obviously we have a cold front coming through um, I bet you'll get down into about the 50s tonight And my husband and son are down in the Carolinas, and he said that it was 90, uh, 95 today. Okay, there's one pocket. And I've been doing so much sewing with this journal, and it's kind of nice just to work with paper. There we go. All right. Get these distressed up.
and it doesn't matter you can see a little tiny bit of the lines there where the perforation where they want you to fold but once you get it um, distressed up and inked up you don't even you don't see that there okay or oh, I might as well do the tags too while I'm at it so this is just going to be a quick little project but I wanted to mainly show you the new digital um, prints that I got from digital fit and <clears throat> I haven't really had a chance to look at everything that they have to offer um, I will later but what I did see I really liked okay all right that'll be good all right so I'm gonna get these I'm just going to put a little tiny bit of glue down on this one so it'll be just a little bit easier to work with and embellish. Just to stick that down a little bit. And then I'll end up using my tape to put them in the pages. And I'm just going to grab Gary and I'm going to set him on there so he can hold that down whoop that didn't work out very well did it I stuck my hand right in it all right and I'm gonna put that one down too and then he can just leave those there okay all right so for the two tags i'm going to try to keep it somewhat well, somewhat simple we'll see here get my ripper and maybe i can do a little pocket within a pocket don't really want to I don't know if I want to rip that or if I want to fold it. Then you really won't see the little emblem there if I fold it. A little bit let's see here let's see what we can do with this let's see let's see let's see I think I might want one of these butterflies. Let me cut out a couple butterflies here. They would be pretty on there. Let's see, I'm going to get my smaller scissors to work on this. Usually I work with my X-Acto knife. I can make short work um, and I can work much faster with my craft knife or X-Acto knife, whatever, whatever you want to call it.
Here it is. I think that's just what I'm going to do. So I, I feel more comfortable working with a X-Acto knife. There's one, and let's get this other one cut out here. find that I've been kind of quiet, more quiet than normal in my videos, but I've just been concentrating on um, you know, what I've wanted to do and I guess too when I'm working with you know, things such like this cutting or I just find myself, I have to pay attention. So. That's why in a lot of my, a lot of my um, videos, I have a lot of things prepped ahead of time. That way it's, it's done and I can be a little more chatty with you and let you know what's going on over here. But, all right, so that's done. Okay, and I'm just going to get that white out of there. Sometimes when you, if you use an X-Acto knife, I, I curl my knife um, when I use it to round things, so it kind of brings the paper up a little bit, and you can see the white on some of the where I cut, we could do something like that. Um, I should probably make this fit first. And I think I'm gonna fold this right in half because I'm having, let's see if it'll work, fold it right in half. if it will work better, I should say. Come on. There. Oh, 
Well, it's a little bit wider. I could probably, I could snip this side off. So I'm going to, I don't know how this is going to work, but we're going to give it a try. I also haven't given this much thought. Um, so that's another reason why I'm just thinking of what I want to do with this. Maybe when I get it done, I won't even really care for it and I won't use it but we'll see how it goes and this is the art glitter glue too so you kind of have to I have to work kind of fast with this because it dries it dries fast. And I'm just going to cut this off here. Okay. All right, so we have that there. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this down as well. And I'll put this on the front and I can wrap it right around the back. fit nice right up there as well. That might look kind of nice. I could put that there. And I could put a ticket. On the bottom here. Our butterfly. We have to make sure I can't have anything hanging over the side because remember it's going in, it's going to be going in this pocket. So, um, we can do a little pocket in a pocket. Let's see here. Um, let's see what I've got here. I'll use this one on the next one. I like that saying. I'll tell you what that says in a minute. I'm just kind of looking here to see. See what else I might use or choose to use.
no daisies in that. Let me see. Approved. Those might be kind of fun to use. I'll pull some of these out with miscellaneous words on them. I might put that on the front. Might be kind of different. And maybe just do something fairly simple on the um, maybe the butterfly on the top. That would make a cute little tab. Let's see here. I want one that goes that goes vertical. You kind of have to kind of have to make up your mind um, sometimes you know you can really overthink it so I'm going to I'm going to adhere this down here. I do like this. It's just simple and it gives a bit of a sim very simple, simplistic uh, little pocket here. Because I have a tag, I already have a tag that I know um, I would like to put in here. But I better check to see if it it might be too might be too tall. I'm gonna put that approved there. I like that as well. I like that as well. Okay. So let me grab that tag. And the tag I saw might be a little too tall, but this might... Open this up a little bit where it's glued. That's kind of cute. So you can have a tag in a tag. I like that. And I like the colors. I like the colors together. And then this tag will be able to go right... Well, that'll be able to go right inside of there. There we go. And then I'd like to put this, I'm going to put this on the front of this here. And of course, I'm not going to put it in the book yet. 
we'll get all the ephemera set aside and made and set aside and then we'll I'll go through and And then I think for, I'm not going to use the butterfly as a tab because that may wear away. I think here I have these daisy, these da daisy tags. And I think I'm going to um, put that on here. I just want to make sure that when it's folded over there we go it is folded properly there and then I'm going to get some ink on the inside so it's not so white if you do see a little bit of that when it's folded over. There, okay. Okay. And then we have this that will go in there. And I think we're going to put a little something else on the front. But then again, maybe I won't. Can always add something to it after so there's there's one tag in pocket and then we will do we will do this one and I am going to use the <clears throat> this green again um, because I do I do like when you pull it out you have the it's a there's two tags in there so second time is always much easier I don't think I did the bottom of this I'll do the bottom and the side of that on
good. It should still be glued. Yep. And put a little bit in on the side there. All right, so let's see what we have um, for this one. That's a distance chart. Let us see. Is there one thing that says? Let's see, maybe we could do a something. I do like the white on this one, though, just because this is so dark. Um, and like I said, I don't mind. I like that yours faithfully. Uh, oh, I'm going to use this one, dear friend. Um, I don't mind if I have a repeat because... Um, They're in different sections of the book, but I think I'm going to try to do use a red because this is the red and pink here. Um, and if I could just find there's one with fake numbers on it. I'm still going to use this dear friend. My regards to your mother, we are both fat and busy, respectfully. I got to put that on there. She'll get a kick out of that. She will get a kick out of that. And maybe I could change, I like the numbers. She's always working with numbers. All right, that there. Um, and Okay, I was going to use that friend, um, but as you can see, I put it back in the pile, and it mysteriously disappeared. Oh, here it is, dear friend. Um, maybe I could put it up here with a little something. Or I could put it on the front of here. I'll put it right on the front of here with this. That would work out rather nicely. Just going to cut this down. Because I do like, I like the looks of that. Okay. Okie dokie. We're getting there. We are getting there. This one I think I'm going to put up a little bit higher instead of on the bottom because I want that daisy to show. Okay. 
Okay. And I think I'm going to put this, I'm going to put this right up here in this little corner. I think that'll be, I think that'll be cute there. All right, and then we will get this on, put the tag on. We don't have to worry about any ribbon um, for the tag because I have the tag holder I'm using. So that makes it a little easier. There we go with that. And I'd like to put another little, just another little number, just another little. Another little goodie down there. There we go. Okay, let me find another, um, oh, we got to do the tag, don't we? Yep. There's a little daisy tag. This one looks to be all good to go. Looks like I've already done the inside of this one, so. This one is good to go. We'll take this out take it out. Look, I'm trying to take it out of the sleeve. You think I've done enough today? I do. I do. There we go. There's the tag for that. And I am going to find a nice um, insert for this. So let me grab some. Let's see. I'm going to bring this, my little kit right over here. Um, we have these that some might be a little too wide um, let's see what we've got let's see what we have here these are a little short a little postcard style and those are short all right let's see let's see what we can what would look nice in here? We could do a little postcard style. That would be cute. This has the pinks on it. Maybe I could do a postcard. For, well, I like that though. But this would be cute in there. I could do a postcard for each, each one. I won't do that because that would be covered up. That's too white for these. All right, I think I'm going to go, I think I might go with these. Although I was saying these are a little too white. Just want to get my what do you 
think about that one. I don't like that. Maybe you could change it out for this one. This would have to be cut down a little bit. That's This is a little too big. That's too big. We're not going to... We're not going to use that. I think that one's pretty in there. And with my lights, it makes it look a little bit whiter and brighter. So, And then this one, um, let's just clear the table here. Um, and then this one will go right in, right in here. And this one will go in here. And then once once these get down on the the um, there, oh, I'm very happy with those. I think they came out really cute. So we have the two pockets from um, Digital Fit, and then um, yeah, here's the tags to go with them for journaling. And then she'll have another really cute little postcard style. Um, tag that she can journal on. These are very cute. So I hope everybody enjoyed this video. Again, I hope it inspires you to create, make something new, put some um, little pieces together that you might not think of. And um, we will continue. And hopefully I will have in the next video, I think I'm going to have uh, much more done and then we can just start loading up the journal and putting the ephemera in it so I want to thank everybody for watching I'd love to hear your comments what you think about this video and the um, the contents of it and I I will see you in my next video have a great night everyone bye bye